I'm Craig Haley in the FCS huddle. The Citadel has really thrown the Southern Conference race upside down in the last two weeks by beating Georgia Southern and then Appalachian State. Could this kind of scenario happen to some of the other major FCS conferences? Well, maybe, maybe not. But this weekend, the Southland can really be thrown for a loop if Central Arkansas can post a home upset over Sam Houston State, which was the national runner-up last year. But Central Arkansas really isn't coming from off the pace the way Citadel has. Out west uh, in, the, in the big sky, Southern Utah has some big games coming up September 29th against Montana State, October 13th against Montana. They can really change the complexion of the race out there. Plus, there's so many schools out there now, 13 schools, that somebody can really sneak in, into that race. The OVC, UT Martin, Tennessee State, they really can uh, have a chance to get into the race in the coming weeks. Uh, the Missouri Valley, the way South Dakota State's schedule shapes up, should they get by Indiana State this weekend, they can really get into the race. The SoCon also has Sanford, just like the Citadel, so that race is really turned wide open. CAA, of course they had Towson last year. They may not have quite the upset uh, darling this year, but you never know. There is, there is a Towson out there. Right now, it's the Citadel. I'm Craig Haley in the FCS Huddle.